Hey everybody, it's me, Jenny B. Welcome back to our channel. <gasps> I broke it! I am here today without Joni B because she is in the kitchen, out that door and down the hall, making soup for the frigid Florida weather we're currently having. It is 40 degrees, so naturally it's soup season. But I am in here to tell you our top four toiletry essentials for travel. Let's just jump right in with the first thing, which is the toiletry bag. Choosing a toiletry bag is kind of serious business. You need something big enough but not too big, something that fits with regulations if you're like us and travel carry-on only, something durable, something maybe kind of cute, something functional. There's a lot of stuff to think about. This is the one I use. It's my favorite, it's by Travel On. Woohoo! There are three compartments. One of them is for your liquids, which is honestly the only negative thing I can say about this bag is that this does not come out. But other than that, I love it. You can hang it up on anything in the bathroom and then it just folds down to this nice little shape. This is my favorite toiletry bag. I'll put in a clip of Joni B's also from Travel On. We're just Travel On fangirls, honestly. These bags are great. They're so well made. They are water resistant. I always, always, always have something spill in my toiletry bag. So this thing is held up. It has served the test of time and I've never had trouble going through security with it. They've never pulled it out or opened it. They just see the liquids and they seem to trust that we're good to go. So this is my recommendation. This past trip, we tried out the Emmy bags and unfortunately I cannot give these the Joni and Jenny B seal of approval. We were sent these by Emmy along with two of their amazing travel wraps. I love those. They're so soft and comfy for travel or even lounging at home. We also got two of their toiletry bags, a small one and a bigger one. The positive thing I can say is that this bigger size is massive. It holds so much. We were able to combine a lot of my toiletries with Joni B's toiletries, which was phenomenal. That part was great. It is water resistant. So when something spills, you still don't have to worry about it, messing up everything else you got going on. Our main issue was really just the quality, unfortunately. These are pretty affordable bags. So that's a good thing. Travel on is a little bit more expensive. So that is one benefit. It did last. This didn't really rip. It just doesn't feel quite as nice as our travel on bags. The one thing that did break was the liquids bag that came with this. I went to pack my liquids bag for a Ryan getaway and the zipper just came off. So that was kind of when the Emmy situation went downhill. However, if you're looking for a really affordable, decent toiletry bag, these are just fine. If you're looking for something to last you forever, this is probably not it. I would go for the travel on. So the second essential is kind of obvious. I mean, you could go out and buy miniature versions of all of your products, or you could save money and buy travel containers that you put your products in, which is what I like to do. So these are from travel on when they send us our toiletry bags, they send us a bunch of travel containers in all sizes and shapes. But I also love these silicone containers from Target. I think they're great. They're about probably 95 cents to a dollar. So they're pretty affordable and they last forever. I've had this one for about a year and it's still as good as new. So pretty self-explanatory. Get yourself some travel containers. Essential number three is kind of just a girl thing. It could be a guy thing, but generally when I'm at home, if I wear makeup, I take it off with micellar water, which unfortunately is a liquid, which takes up space in my already small liquids bag. So to save myself the trouble, makeup wipes. Ooh, these are from Cetaphil. That's the skincare I use. Love these. Also just the generic Walmart simple knockoffs. Love those as well. This saves you a liquid and not that I'm recommending this, if you're feeling lazy, don't wanna wash your face, you can cleanse with this. Skincare experts, calm down. I know you're freaking out right now. But I'm just saying, when you're traveling, sometimes you're tired and you don't wanna go through a whole skincare routine and knowing that you've at least cleansed a little bit makes you feel better about yourself. So makeup wipes. 
And essential, number four, the final essential is kind of the most obscure one on this list. And it is a toothbrush. What? Yes, a toothbrush. I think finding a good toothbrush just for your life in general is very important. And I have quite sensitive teeth, so I am one of those people that has to have a soft to extra soft bristle toothbrush, otherwise my gums will bleed to death. So I am always searching for the best toothbrush and for one that lasts a while because there's nothing worse than using your toothbrush and the bristles breaking off in your mouth. That is just disgusting. The lovely people over at Dr. Plotka's Mouth Watchers sent us these toothbrushes. And let me tell you, these bristles are very, very soft. They're made of polyester, but that means they'll last 33% longer than the traditional nylon bristles, which I am all about. I want a toothbrush to last me a long time. These do. They have normal sizes, kid sizes, but they have travel sizes. Which is why I'm into it, because every travel toothbrush I find that folds up like this has the hardest bristles. And my mouth cannot handle that. So these are great. They also have naturally antimicrobial bristles, which means it eliminates 99.9% .9 of bacteria growth on the brush within six hours. So you can rest assured your mouth is getting cleaned every time and you're not spreading around extra bacteria every time you brush your teeth. They also have dual layered flossing bristles, which I don't think means you're not supposed to floss, but um, let's be real, I don't floss. So that makes me feel great. They have a bunch of different kinds of toothbrushes on their websites. We will link them in the description box so you can check them out and pick one up if you're in the market for a new toothbrush. These are great. Yeah. Well, that concludes today's video. Everything we mentioned will be linked in the description box, especially the travel on travel container and the Dr. Plotka's toothbrushes. So you can check those out. And in the comments, let us know your toiletry bag essentials for when you travel. Until next time, folks, this has been Jenny B. We'll catch you later.